which is why the most wicked thing in it is my sense of humor. I still don't like it, but you are playing with other kids, so I'll take it as a win. Not just playing with other kids, controlling every aspect of the mood. Nobody else is stronger than I am. Yesterday I moved the mountain. I bet I could be your hero. I am a mighty little man. Good. I thought you and Dale might have plans. We might hang out, but that's fine. Something going on? Uh uh. Sounds like something. Well, he's getting ready for your trip. Yep. Dale told me you're taking his camper. Yeah, we're going to head down with Wayne and his wife. Cool. Just out of curiosity, when exactly are you and Mom leaving, and when exactly are y'all coming back? Get back. Sunday. But who's going to watch us? Meemaw. OK, bye. Can you at least give me a hug? I can. Hey, just finish it. That's not how it works, Georgie. I know. I'm just freaking out right now. Let's just go to the drugstore. Right. I feel like I'm going to throw up. Please don't say that. So you've stayed at this hotel before? Oh, yeah. It's nice. They got an indoor pool. Get in. They do not need to hear us argue. Woo-wee! <laughs> hey, Mary! Darling, good to hey. see you. George, how's it going? Good, good. We were definitely not arguing ten seconds ago. And dragons with me, but they canceled. Oh, I'm sorry. We can play with you. Really? Dale, that's nice, but I don't think you'll like it. Afraid I might beat you? Actually, there's no one winner. It's a cooperative game where you... Ooh, fancy. Oh, yeah, nothing says fancy like a two-pound slab of meat. <laughs> oh, shoot. I didn't pack my dress shoes. See, George, it might be helpful if you mention some of these things ahead of time. Here we go. Wayne's always doing stuff like this. No more crusading in the name of good. Okay. You say you got thief on that list? I'll be a thief. That sounds like fun. Okay, I think I got it. It takes ten minutes for the results. Oh. That's ten minutes you could be helping. Now go change whichever this one is. Georgie, there's a band called Guns N' Roses on the phone. Really? Yeah. The guitarist hurt his hand and they want you to feel it. Do that. Do what? Be so happy. You're married. Act like it. How do you put up with him? It's a good question. What's your secret? Communication. Communication? <laughs> oh, God. It could be booby-trapped. Thieves have the ability to check for traps. Good for me. I can do that. Hold it. This chest does not belong to us. So? I'm a paladin. It's not a very... Lane's idea. I appreciate you saying that. And I'm gonna vomit. It's fine. We, we know we appreciate each other. Mary, is it fine? I guess it wouldn't hurt. Well, George... I appreciate how hard you work. I know you make a lot of sacrifices for us, and you don't get enough credit for that. And what exactly would be so terrible about marrying me? I didn't say terrible. You can be afraid of things that are great. Like what? Uh, oh, roller coasters. He just said he did. Pay attention. And you didn't even take it seriously. I didn't take it seriously because you were drunk. That's when I'm the most honest. You can ask anybody at the bar. Okay, fine. That still doesn't change the fact that I'm not interested in getting married again. Pull a beer out of it. Get out of my way. I'm a thief and I'm opening this chest. Have at it. I'm a pal.